Welcome back to Dinkum. I'm very sorry about not having any Dinkum episodes for the last four to five days. I had an eviction notice and I thought I was going to be like evicted like there and then but it hasn't actually happened. It was just a warning um, and it just like really stressed me out and I got a ton of other things going on in my life that I don't really want to discuss right now but um, yeah I've kind of taken, I needed some time away from YouTube to sort things out to decide what I want to to kind of like do with my life and stuff so um, I guess I've been just like I'm just kind of at that age where I just like I want more than what I have right now so I've been sort of working towards that um, I guess I could tell you say the biggest changes I've been doing I suppose which is I'm going to be starting my driving lessons I want to be a little bit more independent than what I am so yes um, I'm obviously still gonna be doing YouTube that's never gonna change I think I'm with YouTube for life to be honest with you I don't think I could go back but sometimes I just need to like take a step back and just like look at everything that's going on around me because sometimes when I'm doing YouTube I just kind of put everything to the back of my mind and I just focus on YouTube and like um, I get obsessed with YouTube sometimes so <laughs> um, I just needed to take a step back uh, basically but I'm feeling a lot better a lot happier I guess I still have stuff going on the eviction thing is still up in the air I don't know what's happening with that right now I've been meeting up with family and getting support from them and stuff like that so uh, that's been helping me a lot so I guess I'll just see how it goes I hope that I won't need to take a step back again but sometimes these things just happen um so it is what it is I I suppose but anyway today I was thinking of uh continuing with this shelter thing that we have made in the last episode it's been a little while since I played I know it's only been like five days on my channel since I actually did an episode but it's actually been like three weeks since I played because I had like two weeks worth of dinkum in advance I like blitzed through a ton of dinkum and then like with all this eviction stuff going on I just like didn't play for for a while I haven't gamed at all in like two to three weeks which is so unlike me I'm always gaming all the time so it's really really unlike me so <laughs> I'm actually really happy to to be back actually um so I did put something in my gacha machine here I seem to have a copper axe um today for whatever reason but that's cool I guess Let's see if I can put something else in there actually I think I just need to grab money wasn't it I think it's money that goes in there yeah there you go let's put some more in there and get that going because might be able to get some good stuff I don't know we'll have to see all right I got some mail let's see what I got in the mail today let's see something from Melvin it looks like I've got a lot of mail who can hear is the dinks <laughs> the dinks are going crazy oh yeah I brought some pots this was to decorate my shelter I remember now and I got some planks from rain I guess that was just like I don't know just uh heartwarming gift <laughs> wasn't something I asked for uh, bug tips for autumn there was a bug in the bushlands oh yeah maybe I'll check it out I don't know I never actually like I always say hey I'll go check that bug out but I never actually do it <laughs> I always say it but then I get distracted by just like a million other things to do and dinkum <laughs> I saw this Nordic couch and thought it would really suit your house thank you that was nice of, of, of them Let's have a look. What does the couch look like? I've actually already got one of those. So, so I guess I got like another one, I suppose. But that's okay. So I want to, I was going to put this up here. And you can put them up there, but you have to jump, which is a bit of a pain in the butt. But that's okay. I'm trying to get a few more plants down these rows here. So I'll probably do that soon. I want to do what I did on this side. Oh, yeah. Oh, I forgot. I was going to pick that up and put that square there. But never mind. <laughs> I'll do that next time because I completely forgot about that. Um, I'm going to go into one of my boxes here. Let's see what I got. Let's have a look. I was trying to look for, I think, palm wood, palm wood pathways. And we're going to, yeah, we're going to just kind of like redo this um, flooring here. So I want it to be the same as the other side so that we have like a bit that's like highlighted. And I just think it would look really, really nice. Whoops. 
Um, I'm not trying to do that. I'm trying to actually do the pathway, but this thing is just in the way, I suppose. <laughs> That's all right, though. Let's see. Why can't I get rid of that? I might have to get rid of, like, the whole thing. Oh, sometimes it's a bit of a, a pain in the butt when it comes to this kind of thing. All right, here we go. Let's get rid of this stuff. That would be great. I'm also going to hopefully go and find the teleporters. Somebody said that, that they think I should do more exploring, so <laughs> I think they're right. I think I do as well, so... I'm going to hopefully do that as well. That would be really good. So then I'd like, I'll be able to like teleport between all the places. How do you get rid of this again? I've forgotten. Why is it not? Why is it not doing what I want? <laughs> get out of here. Oh, there you go. Just took a, like a few hits, I suppose. I'll put that back in a sec. Just want to swap out this flooring like so just i like it when it's like highlighted a little bit and it just like i don't know it just looks really cool so i want to do that put this bridge back over here that would be great if i can please don't be like really annoying i hate when it goes all oh no don't do this again don't do this again <laughs> i hate it when it does this hold on I i'll fix it i'll fix it it's fine i got this Come on, get rid of this silly thing. It could be something to do with these wallings. Could be something to do with these. All right, there you go. I fixed it. It's fine. Everything is good. <laughs> I thought it was like going to go all stupid again. So it does that sometimes with the with the bridges. And it was just like, oh no. <laughs> I was like going to be super annoying. Okay, let's turn this around. Um, it's not going where I want. It's a bit awkward to get your little, little emos and things in here. All right, there you go. They're standing nice and proud and guarding my, my house. That's what I like to see. <laughs> Very awesome. Um, so yeah, I want to put some flowers down there, but I'm still waiting for some to grow. I'm also going to hopefully move this telepad. I was thinking of putting just like a little elevated platform here next to the bank. Uh, I don't know. I just thought it'd look nice there. So I think I'm going to try that sometime. That would be like really nice. I need to sort out all my animals and stuff like that for the day. That would be really good. Let's go see if we got anything in the recycling box today got a few goodies another nordic thing and a white armchair very nice so should we see what this looks like very nice very classic but i like it a nice little table very good awesome stuff i still got some things to get from the researcher that i was working on as well so let's go and like see what's happening in here i just don't think there's anything new on the the tables today but that's okay so what will you show me let's have a look bomb repair table so like i think i've actually got most of the stuff in here at this point apart from the vehicles so i think the vehicles is probably the next thing i'm gonna be working on i would say so like that's cool i could buy something now but i was just thinking i was just wondering if i had a debt so we don't have we don't have any debts okay that's cool then um i might pick up the telepad just pick it up i haven't actually got a location for it right now but i want to pick it up there's also house upgrades to do as well so i also have those to do which i completely forgot about so that's cool i'm just kind of like giving myself a refresher a little bit as well because it's been a while since i played it so <laughs> i do apologize if we have like a bit of a slow episode today i'm gonna pick up the telepads so that'll be good and we'll get a little bit of a debt but like that's fine I don't mind too much. All right, there we go. And we'll probably like move it somewhere soon. I need to like build a little area for it, but let's just pay that off. We are now debt free. Hooray. <laughs> Happy times. I got 147,000 left. I think we should get something from Franklin. Let's do that. I feel like we should get like a vehicle or something. Let's see. I'm pretty sure we got all of these. Don't have a weather station, but I don't think it's like that important. Everything else I think we got. So either a jet ski or a motorbike. I'm kind of leading, leaning towards the motorbike because I don't have any like land vehicles. I don't think so anyway. I need to get some stuff for it though. Old gears, old springs, iron bars. Okay, let's just track it. 
maybe that would be helpful actually and we'll go see what we can we can do here but I'm really like I think this area is looking really good so actually I could probably do with putting a little bit more foliage on this side it looks a little bit bare compared to the other side actually and my little kangaroos over there are having a great time so that's great still lots of decoration and stuff like that to do in the town I got to water those plants as well and I was still working on some sprinklers too so still a few things to do there's still a lot to do actually um so let's go check to see if we got all the stuff I don't actually know how much of this we've got old spring i'm running I, kn I know i'm running out of gears i don't actually have that many gears right now unfortunately we did get a lot of iron last time we went down into the mines right we collected a ton of stuff um some really cool stuff too like you know um dog collars and all kinds of really cool stuff gliders and it was really good the last time we went down we, last time we went into the mines we found so many treasure rooms it was amazing i need some old contraptions and old gears as well here's the old contraptions was it old wheels i mean <laughs> i thought it said gears i was like wait a minute i already picked those up <laughs> okay so here's the bars we gotta just kind of craft a few more of these so, so let's do that that would be awesome and tomorrow in real life um my time at sandrock update is coming out too so i'm looking forward to playing that as well i've actually had an early copy for a while and i just like haven't like i don't know been focused enough to actually like sit down and play it so i'm probably either gonna do that today or tomorrow i don't know just yet but yeah that i, I have a plan i have plans to play that too so i'm very much looking forward to that that's gonna be a lot of fun okay so i think i got all the components i need for this motorbike now so i'm really excited to craft one of these and we can zoom around the town and stuff i think that would be cool i think the the town progress has really been coming along recently like from where we started it took me a while to actually like get started but i'm thinking it's looking a lot better definitely okay let's go and craft this motorbike that would be really really awesome so i've been leaving little gaps here on the flowers so that they grow in they still take a while but yeah like there's there's some like little nice gaps there so that's good anyway let's go in oh no you just closed <laughs> no oh i took too long i'm <laughs> just like messing around today oh god it's okay i'll probably be able to do it tomorrow i'm sure i'm sure franklin will be there tomorrow as well i still got all my chores to do as well i've just been like messing around a little bit today all right so oh wait i actually think i put the things the fertilizer stuff by the thing didn't i i actually put the chest over there and somebody said that i should put a chest with the keys next to the mines as well so i don't forget and i think that's a really good idea i don't know why i didn't do that to be honest with you <laughs> so i should probably do that at some point too uh, that would actually be super useful so there's the fertilizer stuff done and sorted i got my watering can on me so let's like sort that out that would be amazing there we go make sure they're all nice and watered i'm not sure why my wheelbarrow is up here maybe i used it up here for whatever reason but i don't really remember what i was using it for i got some kind of milestone here i think i still need some more licenses so i do need to work on these as well I gotta collect six shells, hunt five animals, and dig up dirt three times. So, so I'm sure that won't be too bad to achieve. I think that those are pretty easy objectives today, actually. So I'll probably work on those at some point. And maybe I should keep doing, maybe I should keep putting the iron uh, on as well so that we can keep making sprinklers and stuff. Because I was in the process of doing that too so let's just keep going with that as well actually we're going to go see what the situation is like over at the at the farm as well that would be great actually we'll go see how that's going so i want to i want to build a kind of decent farm over this way 
probably a lot bigger than what it is currently but this is just the start of it at the moment but the sprinklers are working and yeah it's going well I need to space out these melons better in the future I'll have to make a bigger area for those melons next time because yeah they kind of just like didn't work out too well but <laughs> it's okay I'm stuck I can get through it's really hard to see I'll put my helmet on I got one charge just so that would be a little bit easier to see at the very least. So that's great. All right, there we are. Just water up these as well. Probably should have gotten some water from the... There is a fountain on the way over here. But then again, I guess it's not that bad to just like sort of uh go to the 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 shore anyway like the water's close over in this section anyway so it's kind of a perfect place to do farming because it's so close to the water so i really don't have to go very far so it's actually really good it just kind of worked out that way though i didn't actually put it here because it was close to the water i just put it here because it was like a big space a big open space and kind of don't have that many open spaces left in my town <laughs> as i've been building a lot of stuff everywhere so <laughs> yeah but um it's looking it's looking good it's looking good i'm gonna harvest these and we're gonna like set up some kegs as well also somebody told me that you can put jelly into your kegs so i want to try that so i haven't actually tried that um i've had the jelly for a while but just never actually uh you know done anything with it cooking meat on a stick you want meat so i could probably do that but i don't know if i can be bothered <laughs> seems like it seems like a chore 25 shells that's a lot of shells blue sneakers there's not really anything here that makes me really want to do it maybe the tin five tin ore for three bars is probably worth it theodore i'll do that one the rest doesn't seem like worth the effort i could be, do be doing something else you know there's just like there's so much to do so <laughs> i don't want to like waste time you know so i'm trying not to anyway okay we got some more more like iron here that's great there we go let's just kind of like put some bits and bobs away uh that would be great let's see oh yeah i need to charge up this helmet so let's do that if it works it's working now my helmet wasn't charging before i don't know why <laughs> they must have fixed it or something so that's really cool that that's now working i also have some things to put in my kegs and i did have some jelly but i just don't know if it's going to be enough i only got one piece of jelly i'm assuming that's not going to be enough and i would have to it requires 10 bits of jelly so i would have to like go and farm some some stuff there i don't even have enough to put these in either has it gone up i feel like it wasn't that many was it always 10 i feel like it wasn't that many before but maybe i'm just losing my mind <laughs> could be it could just be that i'm remembering it wrong i have no idea all right okay what else have i got any more like daily tasks or anything i still gotta get some shells and things like that so we'll do that too that would be awesome i gotta hunt down some animals it looks like all my coconuts have regrown and i also have to i'm just gonna hunt down this guy and i also have to feed my animals too so i haven't done that and like pick up their produce that kind of thing so i should get on that as well very soon all right there you go armadillo is down i'm gonna make a little enclosure for the armadillo little guys at some point too i know i'm not saying they're correct like terminology for the game i don't actually know what all the animals are called in this game so i just call them whatever <laughs> I just make it up as I go, basically. <laughs> but yeah, these little guys are awesome. It would be really nice if there was an option to like have labels above like the animals and stuff so you could like see what they're called. You know, like that would be a really nice option. And we're going to get this guy as well. Wow, he died in one hit. Wow. Guy is weak. But we got him. We got him. That's okay. All right, there we go. Got another one of these dudes. Are we done on the thing? I think it may be just one more animal. Uh, the roo is probably going to be a little bit too fast for me, so I'm not gonna, not gonna do that. All right, there you go. Got all the animals, so that's the the daily objective. Hello, Croco Owl. You actually got me. <laughs> I like literally landed right on him. That wasn't too too great, I have to say. I was actually going to go get some shells as well, and I also want to go and see what I need for this teleporter 
as well which is up this way so let's go and like head over there so I'm not sure if I've got all the components for it so we'll have to like check that out probably don't have enough components to get this and the motorcycle because I probably am a bit short with shells not shells um I was thinking of shells because I still got the quest <laughs> not shells I mean wires yeah wires probably it's always wires that I'm missing with the teleporters so I probably have to find some more of those I'm assuming but I don't know all right well there is some nice stuff over here though I'm running out of inventory space like fast but look there's some iron over here and everything fantastic I'm definitely gonna take this iron so I need iron for absolutely everything so it's great to see so much of it over here like oh my gosh must take a while to respawn though probably takes ages I would also take like the copper but I don't think I have enough space in my inventory I really don't so we're just gonna have to leave that for now it's fine it's fine we might be able to take an emu egg home with us as well just for the extra like dough possibly I'm just gonna run past them for now and I'm not gonna like I'm not gonna overstay my welcome they are so aggressive like <laughs> I'm sure they're just trying to protect their eggs or something but it's just like they're just they're just so crazy 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 birds i still haven't even killed one of those to be honest at least i don't think i did i don't think i've killed one of those i think i killed the younger ones you know the ones you can ride as mounts i think i've killed one of those but i don't actually think i've killed one of the big ones just yet that is a challenge for another day <laughs> it's a challenge that i definitely will tackle at some point but maybe not right now so let's see what we're missing for this because i i don't know if i have everything i am carrying quite a few components but i'm not sure so yeah i'm missing a lot so i'm missing green boards cylinders discs wires and slates okay i probably can get those things all right there's that quest done what's my other my other task dig up dirt three times super easy we'll just dig this up and this up there's my there's my like dailies done so we've done the dailies for today so that's great oh look there's some good stuff here okay i'm just gonna chuck those away so i don't need them anyway so we got a few bits and pieces here i wonder if i can just like find the stuff i need without like going home <laughs> that would be great but i don't know um what don't i need i got so much stuff let's just get rid of oh no don't get rid of that did you just oh it's just cloth okay uh just get rid of the shells just chuck the shells for a minute. I was only doing it for the daily anyway. I didn't actually want the shells, to be honest with you. Okay, so what exactly do I need? Let's have a look. I picked up a few pieces, but I think I still need a lot, right? Three green boards, one more hot cylinder, eight wires, smooth slate, and a disc. It doesn't even take gears, so this should be doable but we'll see so I'm not sure how many wires I've got so I'll go check okay I just realized I'm completely out of discs so I can't actually repair the tele tower thing unless I actually like go and look for some discs which I'm not gonna do right now because of how late it is so, so I think I'm just gonna leave it for now, I guess we haven't really made that much progress today, but that's okay. I think we can get the motorcycle tomorrow, so we should be able to do a few bits and pieces. I did bring home a emu egg to sell as well, and I still, I, yeah, I forgot. I've got to, like, sort my animals out as well. Dull. <laughs> I've just been really distracted, just like with other things. Always happens in this game, though. It's just so many things to do. All right, let's see uh, where we can where we can where did I put my my food I've forgotten where everything is it's okay I, I got everything okay there's the bucket the shears we might need that as well I'm not gonna have any room so I'm gonna have to put a couple of these things away what do I actually need for the quest gear spring wheels I don't need everything I don't think so I could probably put a couple of these things away but that's really annoying I was like really wanting to I was really wanting to repair some tele towers. I'll have to like do some some like treasure digging and exploring and stuff like that. That that would be a really good 
idea actually. All right, there's some feed for you guys. Lovely, I actually got some milk here, so I'm just gonna shove those in there. I think that would be for the best. So these feeders are obviously too far away from this to be fed. I actually think these two here are too far away as well. So it's actually only catching like these two in front for the silo <laughs> for like auto feeding. But it's like, I don't know. It's kind of annoying having to like refill this thing. And then it, when you pick it up, it like all the food comes out and I just, it kind of sucks. So I'm not the biggest fan of the silo actually. It looks cool, but I don't know. It just doesn't seem as practical as I would like. Let's just... Let's just say that. <laughs> um, I guess these guys didn't like eat today or something because they're not giving me, they're not giving en me anything. So that's kind of annoying. Did I get ya? I got ya. I should have done this earlier because now it's like really awkward because they're like all in their like little enclosures and stuff. But that's okay. I think I got everyone. I think I got you guys. Oh, look how cozy they look. So cozy and snuggly. Always make almost makes me want to snuggle up in there as well. Almost. <laughs> I feel like it'll be a, just a tiny bit too cold though, don't you think? <laughs> so maybe not. I don't know. All right, so that's all done. I think that's all the chores done for today actually. There might be a couple more eggs in here that I missed. Is there any more eggs? Yeah, there's some more eggs in here. I miss big chicken egg there and one down there as well sorry to disturb you little dude trying to get the eggs <laughs> all right there we are perfect let's put these on then that would be great put these in here shouldn't take too long to cook these up it never usually does so that's great I was thinking of putting some spinning wheels in front in front of a thread space I just feel like it would like match and I don't know, I just kind of like putting things in places that like match the town kind of thing. I'm really curious about what this will look like once this grows and like how much of it will peek through at the back. So I'm actually really looking forward to seeing that grow as well. But I think, oh yeah, there's also the coconuts to pick as well. I haven't done that and I did see that there were some coconuts back here that we could pick. And it seems I didn't finish planting these for whatever reason. I don't really remember why I knocked these down. I don't know. Is that a new bug? Are you new? Hello? A stink bug. Wait, I actually think I've had that before, but it just looked a little different for some weird reason. <laughs> so I'm not too sure. Maybe I'll check to see if I need that in the museum, but probably not. Because I feel like I have picked up one of those before, actually. That's okay. I really need to get on some fishing as well. Fill up my museum a little bit more. That would be awesome. But I haven't really been doing a whole bunch of that um, for at least not for a little while anyways. All right, let's grab all the coconuts. Beautiful coconuts. Is there any more for me to grab? Doesn't look like there is, does it? I think that might be all of them. Oh, there's some up there. See that? Sneaky, some sneaky coconuts trying to, trying to get away. <laughs> but I spotted them. There is no hiding from me. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Perfect. I think it's definitely time for bed because I can't like do anything without my character like keeling over and sort of dying. I actually lost a bit of health today as well somehow. Must have got hit by some crazy animals out in the wild or something. I don't know. But yeah, definitely time to go to bed, I would say. And hopefully the researcher will be open tomorrow. I would very much like that, but <laughs> I suppose we'll have to see. But yeah, definitely got a lot of stuff. Um, hopefully I can sell some things to John today at his store. That would be awesome. We got Rupu. Are you kidding? How much do you pay for this? Like I've forgotten how much it actually costs. Oh, I need to move it, don't I? Let's do that first need to get rid of the square here so that it all matches. I got so many items. <laughs> items everywhere. Just so much going on. Okay, these planks. I don't need these planks. It goes in this box here, I think. I got cloth to sell. I got some shells. Do you think we should keep shells? Do you need shells for anything in this game? Like, I'm really curious to see if it's actually worthwhile keeping them, like, some of them, like, back in my storage box. I'm not sure if it is. I have no idea. Okay, I also want to just grab some palm wood from somewhere maybe this one gum wood 
Nope, I, I don't remember where I put it. I know I've got some somewhere. Is that it? Palm wood. All right, perfect. Just for this like little square in the corner because I'm like super picky. I want to make like an area with more gacha machines as well. I just literally just put this here because I actually think it just looks like really good here in the library. I don't know, I just think it like matches. So I like it right there, but I need to definitely put another area with more of them. That would be awesome. I'll have to work that out as I go though probably that'd be great so yes um i'm gonna put this money away put this money in here let's go and see if oh i'll go get the iron bars bars first and then i'll go see if the researcher place is open that would be really good iron bars i got quite a lot of these now i got 15 of them not bad it looks like we got some more stuff grown over here so we could probably go on like a kind of big selling spree or something so that would be great let's just really i really hope that you're open today you are open yay good job franklin i'm happy this guy is open today i want to buy the motorbike yes so let's commission it that'll be awesome okay obviously we have to wait till tomorrow but that's okay oh i need vehicle license level two. Oh, okay I didn't realize. All right, let's go check. Oh, I actually don't need this on either. We, we can take off the, the helmet. No, we can't. I'm cursed with the helmet today. They still have this glitch. We still can't take the helmet off. <laughs> That's annoying. I'd have to like reload the game to like take it off. I can't be bothered to do that right now. I'll, I'll do it some other time. Um, So apply for license. I don't know if I have enough for the vehicle license or not. I do drive land vehicles yes purchase this one level two license all right nice still got a few licenses to get i was just um lucky oh i should have got that improves the sprinklers i should have got that <laughs> whatever <laughs> it's fine we'll get all of these things eventually anyway so it's not a big deal but i probably should have prioritized better sprinklers over vehicles but whatever it's fine let's craft the motorbike that would be great actually all right here we go so you're interested in my motorbike yes i am all right eighty thousand. yep yep we have an agreement my friend I am very much looking forward to getting this motorbike. It's going to be amazing. A copper street lamp. Have I got this? I don't know. Oh, I actually don't have that. I actually found a new recipe as well. That is awesome. That actually looks kind of cool as well. I like it. I like it a lot. Let's see. Anything? Okay, you guys aren't open today. We're going to go and collect all the poop today. We're going to make up some lovely fertilizer as well. That would be great. Out of the way, ruse. Look at them go. <laughs> I'm surprised they're not dying so I'm not even feeding them. <laughs> but whatever. <laughs> Apparently you, you don't need to feed the wild ones. So I guess that's good. All right, put that in there. I accidentally picked this up and I, I did not actually mean to. But it's fine. I'll just put it back down. All right, perfect. I got some more fertilizer and stuff like that to put in here. Look how much rupu I've got. 210. It was so worth making like a roo farm. Like I'm really glad that I did because yeah, that's just like really awesome. I really like that. So in John's, I think we have quite a few bits and pieces to sell here actually. Let me see. Get rid of these shells. Get rid of the cloth as so we don't need that. Get rid of the wool. Actually, no, because we can make that wool into cloth. So let's not do that. At least not at the moment. I got so much stuff. I got all these coconuts. You can cook them and probably make a bit more money. But I'm too lazy to do that. So I'm just going to sell them as they are. <laughs> For now, anyway. All right, 51,000 is not too bad considering we just spent like a ton of stuff so yeah that would be really cool all right what's on here croco capture for eighteen thousand. i might do that actually maybe yeah let's do that we're gonna do that as well hopefully is there anything in the recycling thing today we've got some glasses oh it's a beak okay sweet okay that's cool so yeah i was thinking of putting some what is this in my hand? Oh, it's the beak. That looks so weird. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking of putting some like little spinning wheels down this line here. Maybe. I don't know exactly what I need to craft them though. So 
yeah it's kind of annoying having a light on when it's like light out already but i can't take it off unfortunately just gonna have to roll with it at the moment i could put like different hat on or something yeah we could do that that's fine that that's better isn't it i just like i don't really like it when it when it does that it's just like it's too bright and it's like too annoying <laughs> so i wanted to like get rid of it kind of thing okay let's just kind of sort out inventory inventory management something that i need to do a lot in this game but that's okay oh yeah i got the the wool let's put the the wool on i'm not being very productive right now am i there's a lot of things that i could be like that i could have active but it's okay so what was i going to put in here i saw something that i was going to put away i guess i can put this one in here the bucket in this one i'm just gonna put all of these components away now because i already use them for the motorbike right so we don't need to like carry them around with us anymore and i got these to put away i got some meat here i think that might be in the wrong one whoopsie i don't like putting things in the wrong boxes drives me crazy all right we'll put these away i got some milk here that needs to go on to the processing thingy majig i know what i mean in the milk machine <laughs> that thing we got some random drumsticks here i got all this cheese i should have sold that but i guess i just didn't notice it or something so my bad also got the stink bug and i got some of this pathway stuff here that's okay though i'm going to go and put this beak in a box so that it's just like there's one less inventory space going on here that would be great actually so let's put this away perfect i got two of those now apparently let's see is there anything else i think we're good we're gonna go and put we're gonna go put this um we're gonna go sell this cheese yeah let's do that as well so then that's not taking up space and we get a little bit of money. I got six cheese. I bet that's going to give us quite a bit of money as well. So get rid of that. There we are. 25,000 just for some cheese. Very nice. I also have some milk here. So we're going to put this on the go as well. That would be great. So I might pop into the museum and see about this stink bug. But I'm pretty sure I've already like... Pretty sure I've already done it. I've got some more cheese here to sell. <laughs> cheese everywhere. It's cheese day or something. I don't even know. Hey, Theodore. Feels like it's been a while since I saw you. I don't think he's gonna... No, he's not gonna. Okay, so the stink bug and the cheese needs to get sold. And I'm just gonna check to see what's in here. Nothing's in there. Don't know if I checked that already. I'm not too sure, but that's fine. Let's see, I got some more things over here to harvest. Oh, I, didn't, I always do that. I always accidentally pick up the flowers. I'm not trying to pick up the flowers. I'm trying to pick up the, um, the stuff, the harvesting. I wanna harvest. I wanna harvest for my kegs. I just keep picking up the wrong thing. All right, there we go. There's another beautiful bush back here. And I actually have a daily quest to harvest these things as well. So I'm trying my best to harvest them, but it's really awkward. <laughs> they just like fall in all the wrong places. So it's a bit of a pain in the butt. All right, there we go. I think that's everything there. Oops, ow, I'm kind of being attacked by fire ah, I should probably stay away from the roofs because I'll probably like set them on fire and stuff and yeah that's probably not great <laughs> not not the best idea anyway all right it looks like you have to harvest the red ones for the quest and I don't actually have that many red ones I need to plant some more red ones right definitely all right we got some tomatoes here as well oh my god just so many chores just like I feel like I'm not gonna have too much time to do anything else it's just like chores everywhere chores just for days i wish i had like a little helper or something <laughs> i need like a little helper to like do these things for me i know you can get like the townspeople to help you and stuff but they only help you with so many things and they always get in the way <laughs> like all the time all right pick up all the tomatoes there we are beautiful and also you can only get the townspeople to help you when they're like off work like some they don't always like help you and you also need high relationship as well i do have high relationship with most of them but not all of them so there is that as well 
All right, eventually I'm going to get rid of all of these tomatoes. I mean, they're going to die when we go to the next season anyway, but I want to put something else up here. Like, I want to decorate this area in front of my house. I probably will do that sometime. All right, there we go. Beautiful. I want to put a little pond next to my barn as well. I've been wanting to do that for a while, but it's just getting around to doing everything, isn't it? <laughs> okay, pick up all the eggs. Get these ones as well. And I might I might go and get some like treasure or something like that today. Perhaps. Let's see if we can fix up that teleporter little thing. I got this egg to sell. So I'm going to go and whiz this over to, to John. It's only 12 right now. So we've got plenty of time. Let's see how much we get for the mute egg. 20,000. Not too bad. And I picked up a ton of tomatoes and get rid of that stink bug and the cheese and this should give us a nice bit of money as well another 39,000 very nice thank you very much John that was awesome and let's see what else we got going on I can get some crocodiles for that that um quest as well if I need more money but I'm actually doing okay with funds nearly 200k is not bad considering you know we do need like a million or something for like the the other like machines and stuff but it's not too bad actually not too bad at all all right let's see I can put some things on here that's great I think what I'll do as well is I need to work on those are still going I need to work on getting some jelly so I really want to try and make some jelly produce it sounds really gross making it out of like actual jellyfish like jelly is nice but making it out of jellyfish itself yeah that sounds really nasty I don't like the idea of that at all but <laughs> oh, we got it we got to try it we got to try it so I haven't actually made any of that yet so that would be really good so let's just like sort out my inventory a second where's my bat my flaming bat is here very nice Got my net just in case I need these things. Alright, that's looking good. That's looking great, actually. So, let's go in, like... I want to go kill some jellies and get a bit of produce. Oh, I should probably, before we do that, I'm just going to... I'm just going to, like, feed my animals and get that done so then I don't have to worry about that. But I'm really looking forward to getting the Mosa bike tomorrow as well. It's going to be really good. Where is the, the food? don't know what I did with it. Did I use all the chicken food or something? I've literally, like... <laughs> it's gone. <laughs> I think I must have, like, used it all or something. I don't know. I don't know what happened to my chicken food. I can't see it anywhere unless I'm just being like absolutely blind. I really don't see it. I don't know what happened to it. Maybe I used it all up. I have no idea. Um, do I have any corn or anything? I don't even think I've got corn. That sucks. I might have to like buy some. I don't know what happened to it. That's really weird. Like, I thought I still had some left, but maybe not. I'm going to use my guitar to... It's like pets your animals, right? They like really like it or something. Aww. Look at them. They're such happy little guys. Happy little chappies. <laughs> That's great. Okay, I'll, I'll do it to these guys as well. So will they all come over to me as well? Aww, look at them. I'm serenading them with my tunes. This is the first time I've actually used this on the animals. So it's pretty cool. It like pets them for you and everything. Apparently, so... That's really cool. I guess you just play it and then everybody gets happy. Everybody loves music after all, right? So that's cool. And also, it makes it a lot easier to, you know, get produce from them as well. So you all come over to you instead of, like, having to, you know, fight with them and to, like pet them and milk them and stuff when they go in their like little shelters that, like really annoying when they do that so yeah there is that too so the barn let's go in the barn I think I might have to actually buy some animal food because I really can't see unless I'm just being blind or something I really can't see where it's gone and I don't have any corn so it's probably the easiest way is to just like buy I don't know, I'll just buy like 40 or something. I don't know what happened to it. Very strange. It's not that much money anyway, so it's not a big deal, but 
There we go. I got 40 fodder here. Very nice. I guess I was bound to run out of, like, food for them eventually, I suppose. Alright, here we go. Feeding time, little guys. I think they're hungry. They're all, like, gunning for the food right now. They always go over to these ones. Having to feed these ones. I'll just keep filling those ones up, I guess. I don't know. Alright, let's go feed the chickens. Make sure you guys got some food. Here you go, guys. So some lovely food for your little dudes. Happiness. <laughs> they look so happy. I'm glad. I'm glad to, to make these little guys happy. Alright, let me just sort out inventory and then we'll do something else. Okay, so I'm going to go on a quest to find discs so that we can fix up this teleporter that'd be really good and then tomorrow we're gonna get the the mosa bike right so that's gonna be really good and then i think tomorrow we'll do some tele terraforming and put down this like platform thing as well so i'm probably gonna put that next to the bank here so i need to do that too oh it looks like i've got apples to collect and some fruit and stuff just kind of collect this on the way past that would be great, actually. So many, so much produce. Let's get it all. Let's get it all so we can get all the monies. Right? That would be great, actually. Some more here. Beautiful, beautiful. I don't know if my bananas are ready. So I don't know if I can make, like, a salad out of it. I might just hold on to it until the bananas are done. So then we can, like, make some salads out of it. And just make a bit of extra money that way. That would be awesome. Are my bananas done? No, bananas always take longer. I don't know why. They always take longer than everything else. It's kind of annoying, but it's okay. All right, here we go. Some limes over here. Beautiful. Lots and lots of stuff. Oh, can't really see very well, but that's fine. Okay, let's go, go, go. Get all the apples. Lovely. There we are. We're going to make a lot of money from all of this, right? So, that is awesome. Did I miss any? Do I have all of the apples? I think we do. I think that's everything. All right, cool. Let's go on the hunt for some treasure. I'm just looking for one disc. That's all I need. Just one disc. Oh, got a bit of a spike there. But yeah, one disc. And then we're going to be able to fix up this last teleporter pad which will be really nice and just really helpful in getting around the world of Dinkum, right? So that's going to be like absolutely amazing. We'll see. Oh, I also need to do this thing. Somebody told me that if you put a planter box on top of bones, you get a new flower or something. So I'm going to try that too. That sounds really cool. I could always do with some more flowers. After all, let's put my little thing on so we can see a little better. That would be awesome. Okay, let's have a look around here then. See if we can find some more treasure. I'm sure there will be. Just have to keep my eyes peeled. What is that? It's a spider. No, a stay away spider. <laughs> I don't like spiders. Oh, there's quite a lot of treasure over here. Let's see, I've got some gears. I'm getting a lot of gears, which is actually really good because... I don't actually have that many gears, so that's great. Some wire there. You know, I should have br bring out some traps in case I found some uh, crocs. There's one right there as well, because I actually have a quest to capture crocs, and the reward's pretty good. I should have, like, bring some with me, but just like, I don't know, I guess I just forgot, I guess. <laughs> That's okay. Alright, let's look around this area then. I see another little thing over here. Let's see if we can... Ah, oh, there you go. Shiny disc. That's what I was after. Now I have one shiny disc. We should be able to go and fix this teleporter up here. So let's go and do that. Okay, here we go. I should... I think I brought enough stuff with me. I don't know now. <laughs> now I'm feeling like a bit nervous. Maybe I forgot a few things. I don't know. That seems to have done it. Oh, okay. Awesome. That did fix it. Yay! And now we can use it to, to go home, right? So I think there's four teleporters in all. I think the last one is like over here somewhere. I haven't actually gone over and explored in that direction. So that's something that I do need to 
to do, but that was a nice little shortcut. Yay! We fixed up another teleporter pad at long last. I probably need to find another disc for the next one as well, right? I'm assuming the, the other one would use a disc too. Not 100% sure, but I'm assuming so. I guess we could go and like see about see about that i should probably take that track off we don't we don't need this on anymore unpin that oh a tin ore to yeah i can do that five tin ore i completely forgot about this quest to be honest with you oh we don't even have that much tin um oh wait i do i do have enough collect five is it the tin ore or the actual it's not the actual ingots is it no they're not the bars i don't even have enough i only got four <laughs> Sad times. So I need to go and get some from the actual like vein, I guess. So that's a bit of a pain to go over there. I would need my boat to go over there, wouldn't I? Let's go get the boat. I think we still have time. I reckon we could still we could still do it. So yeah, I'm gonna do that. See a little bug down there or something. I got an egg to sell to John tomorrow, so that's awesome. So yeah, let's go and see about exploring that little island way off in the distance and see if we can, I don't know, do the next teleporter pad. I don't know if I'll be able to, so I have a feeling I'm gonna need another disc because I don't have any, so not too sure about that. But we'll see. Some gears there. Very nice. Okay. Let's hope that we get a disc from this bunch of things. Keys and wheels and springs. Not quite, but that's fine. Oh, there's some more up here. Let's go get this as well, actually. Let's go and dig all of this up. That would be great. So it's just some wheels and things. That's okay. Wires and toys and stuff. All right. That's fine. Let's keep going then where i gotta go i think i've got quite a ways to go don't i probably taking the long route here we should probably go down this like little path i just is it gonna be a bit of a tight squeeze can you go underneath bridges like i don't know if I, i've never actually tried so i guess we'll see <laughs> hopefully i fit underneath okay you do fit underneath you kind of just like your head just kind of clips through oh look all my corn and that's done Probably should go and harvest that as well. Too many things to do. <laughs> there really is a lot. Okay. Let's head down this way. And we will see what we find. We'll see if we can find something awesome over on that island. It's going to be a bit of a trek. But that's okay. I was going to get jellyfish as well, wasn't I? And I didn't do that either. <laughs> Whoops. Let's see. So I got to go all the way around there. That's going to take a bit. Okay, I made it to the island at long last. That took a really long time to get over it. I hope there is something over here. I was just assuming that this is where the other teleporter is, but it might not even be here. I actually don't know where it is. I think it's meant to be somewhere over here, but I have no idea, honestly. It doesn't look like there's anything too crazy over on this island, to be honest with you. Yeah, no teleporter either. That's a little bit sad. And it's really late now as well. There's a ton of like little islands along this area. I don't know if like there's anything on those. I was kind of like eyeing them up as I was going past them and didn't really see anything that crazy on them. So I'm not entirely sure. See, everybody has different maps. Like everybody has different like also generated maps and I did look at the location for the all the teleporters and it did say it was over on this side somewhere. So I think there is one on this side somewhere. I just don't exactly know where it is. I'm going to go and check this little island here and see if there's anything on there. It is getting very late now, but we should be... We should be okay. It's not going to be like that big of a deal. At least I don't think so anyways. So let's go see if we can find anything over here. There's a lot of sharks out here. So we're really deep in the, the ocean as well. I probably should have waited until I had the the faster boat though. So I think the, the jet ski boat or whatever it is. That one is probably a lot faster than the rowing boat. <laughs> this thing takes forever. So I don't know. What's that? Is that a grave? Did someone die? Is it just a rock? <laughs> I think it's just a rock. I thought it was a grave for a second. I was like, what? That just looks kind of weird. There just being like this random rock in the middle. 
Okay. That's bizarre. There really isn't anything on this island, though. Hmm. Where to find the last teleporter? I have no idea where it is. So, I'm gonna have to, like, keep exploring and stuff, I guess. I don't know. Don't know right now. Unless I go and look up on these islands. I don't know if I've been over there. Let's have a look. Turn around and... Am I dying? I am dying right now. Um, please don't die. Please... <gasps> I just died. <laughs> I just passed out. No, I was literally about to eat an egg. I was literally about to. Oh, no. Oh, God. That's annoying. And that also means my boat is, like, in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> oh, God. That was not too great, I have to say. Well, these things happen sometimes. <laughs> I hope I didn't mo lose that much, mo much money. I don't know how much it takes off you, but I had like nearly 200k, so I'm a little bit worried about that. Maybe I should have like put everything in my bank, you know, if you get like a big amount of money. Maybe that's what I should have done. Why is it taking so long? It doesn't usually take this long. It's still going. Don't say I've crashed on the loading screen. It's taking forever. I think I've crashed. It's not doing anything. Ooh. I've been waiting for like a couple of minutes now and it's like, it's not doing anything. <laughs> I think it's crashed on the saving screen. That's just like really worrying. But I don't think there's anything I can do. So I'm just going to have to close it and um, try again. I know you shouldn't close it when it says it's saving, but it's been saving for like half a year. I'm not waiting anymore. So I'll just have to reload it. I just hope it doesn't do anything to, like, my save file or anything. That's a little worrying. Okay, I've loaded it. I don't know... Did I lose the day? I might have lost the day. I don't actually know. Wait, Franklin has sent me mail. Let's have a look. Is this my motorbike? Okay, I didn't lose anything. It just crashed on the, the loading screen then. It just really worried me because... Like, it was on a saving screen and it just, like, really freaked me out. But we got the motorbike. Yay! The motorbike looks really cool. I love it. That looks amazing. Let's zoom around. Let's just, like, have a blast. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to use it that much, but it's cool. It is really cool. It's, I think it's going to be, like, one of those novelty items, if I'm being honest with you. But I do like it. All right, hang on. Change my hat. Oh, you can like jump with it. How do I do? I can jump. I can do like I can do like flips. I do like wheelies and stuff. Woo! <laughs> Let's go crazy. Let's do some like tricks and stuff. You could like make a little. You could make it like a little race track or something with this. With like um, I'm sure you could build some like little ramps and stuff. That would be so fun. That would be amazing. It's giving me some ideas here. <laughs> That would be so cool. It would be a lot of work though, but it would be cool at the same time. Whee! This is so awesome. I love it. Very cool. Very cool. I'm really happy that we got this. I don't know where I'm going to put it. I haven't quite worked that out, but I think it looks really nice. I think I might put it in my shelter, perhaps. We'll have to see about, see about doing that, I guess. But yeah, it looks really cool. Really happy with it. Really cool item. So I guess the progress that we've made today was I spruced up the shelter a little bit. And we did fix one of the teleporters. So we fixed this one at the very top here. And I did go on a mission to try and find another teleporter. But it didn't quite work out so well. And my robo is now stranded. But I'm sure we'll fix that. <laughs> so that will be fine. So how much money did I lose? I lost like 50k I think. So it's kind of like a bit annoying. But it could be worse I guess. And I think tomorrow we'll get the boat. We'll get like the jet ski boat. We'll do that. Um, I might put some spinning wheels down here. I might craft some of those. Maybe craft some more sprinklers. And you know make a bit of progress on the sprinkler system over here as well. I also forgot to... 
harvest this i was meant to harvest all of this as well and i didn't get around to it so i got that i got all this to do when we play next time as well so lots of stuff to do anyways i hope you enjoyed this episode thank you so much for watching i just want to say a huge thank you to all of my patreons and members for supporting the channel thank you so much i really appreciate it and if you are interested in donate donating there will be a link in the description box below to my patreon page alternatively you can also click the big join button underneath every video that i create to become a member of the channel i also have a dedicated live streaming channel that you can find on the in the description box below or on my channel homepage. i regularly live stream over on that channel and it would be super cool if you could stop by sometime and say hello i would really love that thank you so much for watching this episode please comment rate and subscribe and I hope I'll see you next time.